Hey guys, I just did my uh, unboxing of my Tackle Warehouse uh, order and I didn't really get to open up these, uh, the Revenge Swim Baits, I'm sorry, the Swim Jigs and the Project Z Swim Jigs. Um, so I opened them all up and, you know, I was kind of looking at the, here it is, here's the uh, swim, Project Z Swim Jigs and I was really impressed by the color scheme of the Z-Mans. Um, lo and behold, I mean, they're all great. Don't get me wrong. They're all going to catch you fish. Um, but here's my in-depth analysis. So straight off, you have the Project, uh, Project Z at the top, and you have the Revenge. And I'll be 100% honest with you guys. Uh, the Z-Mans are good, but I can tell why uh you know they just they just started them so uh what i mean by that is if you look closely um and i'm gonna try to get a uh a good shot of it i don't think i can it's gonna be almost impossible um the skirt isn't even aligned properly and granted it's gonna be like that um after you fish it for quite some time but I mean, not out of the package, and I'm trying to find the best angle to be able to showcase this, and I may be able to show you right there, and if you guys can see, at the top right-hand corner, uh, probably right around that, you know, right there, if you guys can see, I mean, it just literally is missing half the skirt, well, <laughs> not half the skirt, a quarter of the skirt, so, um, don't get me wrong, I mean, it's still really good, and it's really gonna still catch you fish, and I just turned on the brightness, but you would just expect that it was going to be the same skirt design as let's just say a chatterbait the project z's which come you know pre-made and let me try to focus right there that's what i thought the skirt was going to be but it wasn't so it seems like every one of them have kind of a, a flaw to them i mean as far as the skirt um no, I mean, gosh, it's hard to really like navigate towards. This one's not so bad. I already cleaned this one up and tried to move the skirt around, but as you can see, the uh, chartreuse isn't, you know, really at the bottom. It's kind of to the right hand side of the lower. Um, so, and then if you see on this side, it's more black, white, uh, and I would say green pumpkin. And then on this side, it's black and chartreuse. So. Not really sure. I'm just gonna have to spin that around, and make sure it looks right. And I've already kind of fixed the uh, the bluegill. And as you can see, kind of the left hand side, uh, we're missing some strands, so I'm gonna have to fix that one. You can kind of clearly see that there's a. Uh, let me try to focus on that one. You see how there's not many strands by that rubber band. When it comes down to the revenge, um, you know, head design, I mean, it looks phenomenal, as you guys can see. I'm trying to get it a close up. I mean, it's a really good looking head. Let me try to get this better. I'm sorry for the focus. I'm doing this on my phone because my GoPro won't work right. I mean, this is Green Pumpkin. Just looks really good. And nowhere did I see any type of flaws um, with the skirt. I mean, as you guys can see, I mean, the skirt looks really good. It's uniform. It's going around the hole. And let me get you a brighter color so you can kind of see it. And this is the uh, bluegill pattern. And as you can see, that's the top of the head. And it just matches. I mean, literally, it just matches going down. I will say that the weed guard on the Z-Man, I actually prefer. It's There's more strands, but it seems like it's just as flexible. As a Revenge. And it's just that much longer, as you can see. That's the Revenge. And that is the Z-Man. So it's a little bit longer. It can be a little bit more weedless. But um, it's kind of my review of the uh, 
the Project Z against the Revenge. I actually, I think I would rather prefer fishing the Revenge. While I do like some of the colors of the Z-Man, like the baby bass. I mean, the baby bass looks really good. Kind of reminds me of a frog pattern, but I mean, it looks really good. So, um, I also like B uh, the bluegill. I mean, it looks really good. I just wish it would make more sense that why couldn't they just use that skirt? Um, I get it could be uh, due to the weedless design um, of a swim jig and what the purpose is, because it doesn't obviously have that uh, that that strand glue or whatever you call it, that silicone. But uh, I just wish they had a better design for this, because or maybe a quality assurance. But as you can see, it just this revenge, the head, the way it's designed, it automatically kind of helps it slip into cover and slip out of cover. It has like a, uh, a design where it just kind of goes right over those uh, skirts. And the thing looks really good. I'm really impressed. Heavy duty hook, I like it. So it's kind of my uh, analysis on the Z-Man swim jigs compared to the Revenge. I'm not gonna lie, the Revenge just quality wise definitely seems a little bit better um, I will be ordering more of the uh, revenge in the future so uh, I am a fan all right guys sign out